Israel police have now released senior Jordanian Muslim cleric Sheikh Abdelazim Salhab from custody after arresting him and his deputy Najib Akira on Sunday for instigating disturbances in the Temple Mount last week. Now, the Bab al Rame Mosque has been closed since 2003 by court order due to the destruction of artifacts by Hamas affiliated groups under the guise of still illegal renovations. But on Friday, hundreds of Muslims broke into the closed off Bab al Rame Mosque behind the Gate of Mercy in the Temple Mount complex. And this just a few days after already holding violent protests and prayer services outside the gate. But this time, despite days of rising tensions, Sheikh Salhab personally opened the gate. And in fact, just to avoid any violent clashes this time around, Israeli police had to arrest dozens of suspects and seized multiple weapons on Thursday night ahead of the planned break-in. Still, the PA and the Jordanian Waqf, among others, are blasting Israel for supposedly changing the status quo on the mount, which is a common diversionary tactic especially as the only ones changing the sensitive status quo in recent weeks, is the Jordanian Waqf itself, which oversees the Temple Mount holy sites as part of a decades-old deal with Israel. For example, just over the last two weeks, the Waqf Council expanded for the first time ever to include Palestinian politicians and religious leaders. And then, violent clashes were mounted against police at the site. As such, Sheikh Salhab, Deputy Bakira, and multiple others have also been barred from visiting the Temple Mount complex for at least seven days.